Hi guys, welcome back to another Steam free to play. Oh, not Steam, not Steam. HIO free to play walkthrough. Today we have Aqua Creep, which really sounds like a. It really sounds like a um, it game. You know uh, the thing. Okay, I gotta turn this shit down. It's too loud. Holy crap! Can't even hear myself think. All right, but it's like uh. He's got mad asthma. If you ever watch The Thing by John Carpenter, that's what it sounds like. You basically have to figure out which one of your crew is a monster. And like, um... Basically everybody looks like a human and there's a monster in the mix that looks like a human as well and you have to figure out who you can trust. It's like a psychological thriller kind of game. Is this going through my headset? Yes, it's just super loud. My God. Ooh. That's one of my bigger complaints about HIO games. They usually don't include like um, a sound menu. <laughs> but I mean, I guess it's easy enough to fix. But face to talk to Thomas. What's up, Thomas? In. Oh, he's got like a voice actor. A rough one. You need a hand with anything out there? Nah, I can take care of this. What are you going to do? Uh... Good call. Not like we can get anything done until the storm blows through anyway. Well, I better dun, get my dun, shit together dun. here before it lets loose on us. My guess is it's going to last all night. Maybe longer. Is there a run? Oh, there is a run key. Thank God. Good job, game developers. Way to put it in a run key. That's that's clutch. So important. You'd be surprised how many games forget the run key. Dive storage. How do we change out of our wetsuit? Nice. Now we're ready to fight a monster. Ah, screwdriver required. Apparently every game to play changes and there's like new obstacles every time. Just wanna make sure I'm not missing anything because I wanna survive. This is a really cool game. The graphics are really good for an HIO game. Oh, this is kinda of creepy looking bathroom, ain't it? Need a screwdriver, right? Yeah, cool. Look at that mirror. You can even see a reflection, that's super dope. Is that a screwdriver? What's this? Oh no, that's just a drain. I was like, dang, we found the screwdriver already? What's it doing in the shower? So it seems like the camera's fixed, which it's not that big a deal. It seems like everything's pretty viewable. They did this really well so far. And then when we start actually getting chased by the monster, it will all unravel super fast. Oh, it's a girl. I think. Isabel, everything cool? Yes, I was I right. I suppose. The storm is most inconvenient. The timing couldn't be worse. We were making excellent headway on the project, and now we have to put it all on hold to prep the facility before it hits. Wham. Oh, no, I'm just kidding. Uh. I appreciate that, Dean, but no, not Am I too stupid to help? Frankly, the situation just sucks, and there's nothing to do but wait it out. I just hope we don't lose power. That could create critical circumstances for the project. Critical Look, circumstances, you say? I don't say. need to brush you off or anything, but I need to focus on getting some things in order. I'll speak to you later, okay? This bell seems kind of evil. She might be a monster! A monster! What's up, Dave? Hey, oh, Steve. Same Steve. What's a good word? Not a whole lot. That's but a good word. No news is good news, right? Kind of creepy. Heck of a storm brewing out there, ain't it? Nothing here for you to do. Most of the essential equipment is locked away for. Where is it locked away? There's some minor procedures here in the lab, but it's nothing we can't handle on our own. Thanks, though. Should be a pretty heavy storm. The radar was showing a lot of red. We'll be fine, though. The Institute keeps our preparations pretty thoroughly stocked. Hmm. Good for you. What about me, though? 
There's nothing for me to do. Is there anything I can grab like a screwdriver? That'd be real cool. Crew quarters. What's up, crew? What's up, jerk? There you are. I was worried I wasn't going to meet my asshole quota for today. <laughs> Have fun playing Aquaman this morning. Yeah, it was awesome. Oh, what? Too much time underwater make you too sensitive to take a little joke. Bro, I was just offering if you need help. Man, I thought you were a little tougher than that. But no, just packed away and cleaned the last of the gear. Hey, by the way, you heard the crew is meeting up in the rec room for the storm, right? I did not. I'll be the one getting drunk off my ass, so come have a beer with me later, okay? Oh, we're gonna smash. No, she's gonna try to eat me. She's a monster, I can tell. Is this my room? Oh hell, my room's nice. Oh, we're not going to sleep yet. We got stuff to do. But we do know where to go to sleep now when we need to do that. Progress. Recreation center. Any screwdrivers in here? What's up, man? Howdy, Chuckles. Howdy yourself. Looks like we're in for a bit of a colorful weather, huh? You stoked for the party tonight? Oh, yeah. What, the party? Or the storm? Cause either way, we're all set. Everybody's all set, I'd apparently. I'd say go pick up some ice if the nearest landmass wasn't 30 nautical miles inland. I think we'll manage, though. But yeah, this part is gonna be rad, man. Everyone I've talked to about this is pretty amped. Isabel seemed a little bummed, but I guess that's just because she'd rather spend the night with her sea snails. Hey, more alcohol for us, right? Hey. Never have enough alcohol. Look at that thing. That thing on the wall's pretty creepy looking, ain't it? Hey man, how's What's up, it looking? Trevor? Oh, hey dude. Back in the dive already? What's up with this voice? Yes, we're in for some rain, huh? Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah, well, you know the drill. Not really. Storm's the talk of the town right now. Woman seems a little on edge. I think she's worried the facility won't withstand the He hit. said something that I'm sure we'll do it's fine. not these... If yeah, forecast says the main cell should be over us in about an this hour. This text is not matching up. Guess we'll find out how built the last this place is. That was weird. Is that a hint? Is that a hint that he's a monster? Because what he was saying was not matching up with the dialogue. I'll keep that in mind, Trevor. Come on to you. I'm pressing space. Interact with it. This room's broken. Space! I don't know. Can't do it. I'm on to you, Trevor. Excuse me. Security room? Up, girl. Hey there, Emma. What's cracking? Everything all right? You seem kind of twitchy. To be honest, I'm sort of wigging out a little. I've never been in a tropical storm before. That's nice of you to offer, but there's nothing left to do. Silly, right? Like we're as prepared as we can be out here, and I'm still a nervous wreck. But Nobody it's not wants just my help. Storm. I'm so useless. I just have this unnerving feeling, like something bad is about to happen. I can't explain it. Like, there's the storm, but then. So her dialogue is matching what he said earlier, what feeling, Trevor said. Like something isn't quite right. Like what she just said was the dialogue for what Trevor was saying. Was not saying. Well, I don't know how to it's match it. Their dialogue nothing. matches. I'm sure I'll feel better once everyone's together in the rec room when it hits. Or we'll all die in the rec room together because there's a scary monster. I'm thinking that's the one. There's the helicopter pad when we need to escape. Alright, well, we did not find a screwdriver, so let's go to bed, I guess. Clip, clock, 
clip clop, clip clop, clip clop. Such a cab. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, that's where the sleeping spot was. It's bedtime. Do 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 do. The mosh, the storm will be hitting. Uh oh, that's not good. Who's hollering? Who was murdered first? Oh shit, this is kind of creepy looking. I'm like all dark. You're good, Ash, and I'm bad, Ash. You hear that scream, dude? Hey, buddy, what's up? Come to think of it, yeah, I have. I think it's strange you aren't taking advantage of a drunk Rebecca. You know she likes you, right? Yeah, I know. Hey, never Busy. mind all that. How about you kick back and relax, huh? I remember, we're getting paid for this. <laughs> Who's this? Hello, Emma. Oh. How are you holding up? Just different what, because of the storm? I'm doing surprisingly well. I'm not sure what you mean. I've been here the whole time, and nobody's been screaming. But I gotta say, this has turned out pretty nice. Not often we're working and having downtime are one and the same. I'm having a pretty good time. Huh. Hey Tommy, can I bend your ear for a moment? You wanna talk? Sure. How you doing, man? Screaming? I mean, sorta. It's kind of a party if you missed it. Know what I mean? God, how does nobody hear that noise? Shaking it, getting drunk. I fucking love parties, man. <laughs> Anywho, sure beats work. Am I right? I guess, but hey, what's up, Rebecca? We'll talk to you last, cause I know what you want. want this deal. Okay, I wasn't supposed to interact with it yet. That's why it wouldn't let me interact. No, that's a bad idea. Ah! When in Rome. Oh, do I not get the option after I say no? Oh, wait, there we go. When in Rome. Hey, Rebecca's getting down. This is so strange. <laughs> the moves. He's an alien. Who are we missing? I don't think we're missing anybody, are we? Oh, we're missing the scientist chick. And, yeah, the scientist chick, that's who we're missing. Remember that, guys, we're missing the scientist chick. She was screaming. Hours later... Oh, I wasn't supposed to drink yet. I was supposed to talk to people. Is that me? Oh, I'm dead. Plot twist. I was not supposed to drink the alcohol. Alcohol is bad, kids! I think. We'll see. Don't eat me, monster. I'm not ready to die. Oh, shit. That thing is creepy as hell looking. Run, mother... You booze, you lose! Ah! <laughs> you booze, you lose. Well, wonderful. You booze, you freaking lose. Oh, uh, who would have imagined? Where you know, kids? At least we had a good time before he died, I guess. Hey, Rebecca, I have to ask you something. Oh, hey, what's up? Drinks aren't for counting, oh, they're for true. drinking. 
Thanks. Come on, what are you waiting for? Grab a drink and join the fun. I can't. I died last time I did Steve, that. Steve, you got a minute? Oh, hey, Dean. Where's your I was beginning to assistant? wonder if you were going to sleep right through the party. Say, you don't look very good. Are you sick or something? Almost. Isabel insisted on watching over the project mm. over in the lab. As smart as she is, I wish she'd realize the rarity in this situation. We rarely get this kind of opportunity. Doesn't seem to be a microscope known to man to get her to see that. Look, you already why got don't you the try monster to enjoy dog. the party? It's not every day the Institute signs our checks to kick back and relax. What's up, dog? You're looking like you're freaking out. Let me ask you something. You didn't happen to hear someone scream a bit earlier, did you? Scream? Where'd you hear a scream? Well, I'm not entirely sure if it was a scream. I was asleep when I thought I heard it. But it kind of sounded Covered like it came from towards the equipment storage. Listen, man. I need to talk to you. But not here. Oh, shoot. In the security room. Don't tell anyone. And come alone. You got me? You don't hate me, Trevor? Trevor? you're kind of freaking me out a little. What's wrong? What are you... Shh. Not here. You walk out first and head over to the security room. I'll meet you there. I don't think so, dog. I need to tell somebody else I'm going. Who who can help me? Hey, Tommy, can I bend your ear for a moment? You want to talk? Sure. How you doing, man? Well, yeah, man. Of course. Aren't you? Okay. I was hoping it was going to give me a new option. Am I right? Get somebody to come with me. I'm kind of scared to go by myself because I feel like he might kill me. I think he might kill me. I think he's a monster, but I'm not sure. Well, before we go to the security center, let's go to the lab. I'm pretty sure that's where that one chick died. Big brain. You'll never catch me alive, Trevor. Oh, she's still alive. What the heck? Isabel, can I bother you for a second? What do you need? A screwdriver. I'm not sure. I've been pretty wrapped up in my work here. I thought I might have heard something like a scream, but... I figured it was just the party or maybe just the storm. Yeah, the storm no, just screamed. Excuse me, Dean. Yeah. The project requires my undivided attention. Dang it, Isabel. All right, I guess we'll go to the security room. And die. All right, don't eat me, Trevor. You freaking gargantuan monster. Beanie, beanie, fofini, popini. Dun dun dun! I don't wanna die. I don't wanna wait for my life to be over. So, Trevor, you gonna eat okay, me? Okay, I'm here. Now, what's this all about? Okay, listen. This is gonna seem weird, crazy even. But after what I saw, I really don't know how else to describe it. Okay, Trevor it. might not be the Jesus, monster. Jesus, Trevor, man, you look like you saw a ghost. What happened? I, I think I know. But I don't want to say. Not until you've seen this first. You, look, you see that monitor there? Keep watching. You don't hate me. This dive storage? Oh hell, what's that? Wait a minute, who is that? Who is that? That's a female for sure, right? That's a blonde, ain't it? Good lord. What the hell did we just see happen? Somebody just got attacked by something. Who and by what isn't exactly clear as you can see from the video feed, but whoever it was got back up and shook it off like it was nothing. Yeah, then it looks like they changed clothes and just left. You don't think whoever it was is still in the rec room with the others, do you? I don't think we can rule it out just yet. We came from there just though so I earlier the today. Page. You agree that was what it looked like, right? Like we both just saw what looked like some kind of animal attack somebody. Then that somebody getting back up and leaving like nothing happened, right? It have been I me. saw it, but I'm not sure I believe it. It's gonna have to be good enough, I guess. Here, 
take this. Your driver? Wait, you're giving me your gun? Why? Don't worry. I'll keep a spare and some ammo in the security locker. I need you to have this because you're the only one I can be sure is human right now. How can you be sure we're human? About the screams you heard in the rec room earlier. What do you mean, is human? I mean, between what you witnessed and what we saw I in the think security I might be the monster. <laughs> somebody out there isn't who they say they are. You're telling me that someone in that this facility isn't really a person? That would make sense. Why would the monster kill me then? But I, I think that might think just be a penalty for drinking. alive anymore, Dean. Whatever that fucking thing was is now running around pretending to be human, and nobody but you and me have any idea. Holy shit. What if there's more of these things? If that's what we're dealing with, then how are we supposed to know which one of us is really human? I don't have an answer for that yet. For now, keep that gun on you and look around for clues. Probably start in dive storage. Maybe you can find something we missed in the video. At least it gives me a hint of where to go. Trevor. How can we be sure about this? I mean, fuck me, what if we're wrong? We'd be talking Try not about to cuss, you can't cuss, game. game. I'm but trying not, not to cuss. We're right. No. You know we can't take that risk. Look, I need you on this one. Right now, it's you and me who got to protect the rest of our crew hey, out there. Hey, let's go. We can't let word get around until we know for sure what we're dealing with. True. I'll head back to the rec room and cover for you. Find out whatever you can. And remember, not a word of this to anyone until we know who it was on that tape. Good luck. Thanks, fam. Oh, shoot, I'm actually carrying the gun. How do I shoot it? Oh, you right click and you target. Can I just start shooting everybody? That's awesome. They don't really give you game the guns are scary games. That's pretty cool actually. I'm excited. The laboratory in Dexter's lab. Past the vaulted door lies a world of mysterious things the world has never seen before. Dexter's Laboratory is the smartest boy you've ever seen. I don't remember the words. Close his experiments to smithereens. Oh, hey. There was something. A shredded and bloody wetsuit. Who did I see wearing a wetsuit with this pattern earlier? Me. Was anybody wearing a wetsuit earlier? I don't remember anybody wearing a wetsuit earlier. A shredded and bloody wetsuit. Who did I see wearing a wetsuit with this pattern earlier? The blonde? I think it was the blonde. I don't remember. I should look at the video footage. Am I stuck? I think I'm stuck. Who did I see wearing a wetsuit with this pattern earlier? Stuck. I'm legitimately stuck. I don't know what's going on. But I know Umu is a monster. What's going on? I'm winning. Still stuck. So shredded and bloody wetsuit. There's no. Think we're gonna have to start up. Stop hitting the space key. I'm trying to get. I'm trying. To, I'm used to jumping to get the fuck out of the spot when I'm stuck. Yeah, we're gonna have to restart. That sucks. Hey, what color we got? We know it's a dude. Orange. Shredded and bloody wetsuit. Yep. It's the orange haired dude. Wearing a wetsuit with this pattern earlier. Orange haired dude. 
Hopefully I'm not stuck because I looked at it. Thank gosh. Just stay away from the locker. Alright, where you at, Charles? Is that his name, Charles? Orange haired dude, he's getting shot in the face. They're gonna be like, why are you shooting Charles? And I'm gonna be like, yes, he's a monster! You do look pretty creepy when you're out in the rain, right? So I was trying to back up, right? And it just kept moving forward at the monster. I don't know how you're supposed to do combat when you like target on it. Maybe I should just stay away from it. That was kind of cool. Those noises were kind of creepy though. You were eaten by the aqua creep. Well, the aqua creep's a dang old jerk. How about that one? Is Sean still the monster after I go to the checkpoint or does it change? That's a good question. We'll find out now. Darn you aqua creep. <laughs> that thing makes some noises though, doesn't it? That was kind of creepy. Oh, it's the same one. So it doesn't change. Bloody Who did I see when I shot him by an accident too. That was my bad. I was trying to target the monster. But you see, like, it runs at... Maybe I need to try the, like, inverted controls or something. Because it's like running at who I'm targeting. Instead of like backing up, I'm like trying to back up, but he just keeps running forward and I don't know why it's doing it. We'll figure it out though. We know it's Sean though. He's a scary monster. Oh, it's the rec room, not the crew quarters. Alright, Sean. Oh, so you gotta like untarget it. Oh, I shot Uma again. God dang it. I don't know how to get away from it. Damn it, Sean. Stop killing me. I could snipe him from like one of these rooms, but I really don't want to do that because I don't know if I'll kill him or not. I'm trying to make sure he dies. Maybe I just stay still. Maybe he won't get me if I stay away from him. I don't know. I need to stop shooting Uma though. Went as well as could be expected. You think? Man, it got up through the ceiling panels. Who knows where? Oh, that was right creepy. Now. Shit, bullets don't kill this thing. What the fuck kind of options does that leave us with? Just bringing in outside help until we can. 
you've got a point. I guess it's just a matter of finding it again and finishing the job. <sighs> Tough SOB, I guess. Okay, look, forget all that right now. We need to think of what our next move is. Maybe something in the lab could... Oh, fuck! Oh, Isabelle's in the lab, all by herself. She has no idea what just happened here. Wonderful. Rebecca, are you hurt? I'm okay, thanks to you. How did you know that thing wasn't human? It looked like the real deal as far as I could tell. Well, it's good to know you didn't just start blowing people's heads off with no reasoning behind hey, it. Hey, you already know. I'm smart. I'm scared, Dean. Dang, I was hoping we'd kill it there, but I, I guess like not. Any one of us could be next. And if I can't tell the difference between one of our co-workers and some kind of monster pretending to be one of us, how I don't know, dude. I think we're screwed. <laughs> That's what it does. Hurt? Did it get a hold of you at all? If you're asking if I'm really human, you can relax. Give it to me straight, Dean. What do you know about all this? Ah, oh, hell, I hadn't even thought of that. That means... That means we're basically up against this thing on our own. At any rate, things aren't looking too good for us right now. We'll all need to stay vigilant. Might be a good idea if we all stay far away from each other. That would be better then if we again, stay close together. Maybe that's the last thing we want to do. Did it get to you? It didn't touch you, did it? No, I I, I saw it coming and I, I, I ducked as it passed me. Hmm. I just, I just knew something horrible was about to happen. Where did it come from? What was that thing? I don't know. What if I just killed everyone? I guess... I guess you really couldn't tell anybody about it then. Not until you were sure who was human. I should have followed my instinct. Even before signing up for this, I had bad feelings. I think Isabella's screwed, pretty much. So now you see what we're up against here. I see it, but I can't quite put it into words. What just happened here, Dean? What was that thing? I hope you're right about that. <sighs> Bloody thing was the most horrific creature I've ever laid my eyes on. Yeah, my nerves scary are looking. still all shot up. Keep trying to calm myself, but the way it just appeared like that. <laughs> Good lord. I could have sworn it was human. Yeah, that was pretty creepy looking. Oh, we're screwed, it seems. Can't wait to see Isabella freaking murder me. That'll be great. At least it does like save point, and as long as you don't get stuck or anything like that. The laboratory. What's up, girl? Isabel, we need to talk. <sighs> this had better be an emergency. I was gonna grab her ass up. Very serious problem. I don't know if you're willing to believe this, but a member of the crew was killed by some kind of creature. The creature then went on to disguise itself as human. Son of a bitch! I knew it. How'd you know it? I mean, I had a feeling. I figured it couldn't have gotten too far. What? Allow me to explain. You see, the project we've been focusing on recently you knew about it started it. out with mollusks and sea snails. Until we discovered what we thought initially was a completely new species. Damn it, Isabel. A small Isabel. green slug with yellow spotted patterns along its sides. Nothing about it seemed particularly noteworthy until one day we discovered its more fascinating How attributes. How do we kill it? Shape shifting. You gotta be shitting me right now. No, I'm quite serious. 
We placed the specimen in a terrarium alongside other species. We were shocked to find as the amount of new species would seem to disappear, more of the more common species would proportionally be present. We found that... No, not the fact that it can shapeshift. I mean, you can't possibly mean to tell me that thing that's out there picking off the crew is some aquatic slug. I've seen it on video, partially at least, and I can tell you it was no slug. Yeah. This thing had legs. Thing was terrifying. That's what I was getting to. We found that not only could oh. it mimic other species at a cellular level, but in ingesting other organisms, it seemed to rapidly evolve. In many cases, acquiring mm -hmm. attributes derivative of its prey. So you're saying this little sea slug can mimic its way up the food chain and become just like whatever it eats? I'm saying it doesn't end there. Just because it consumes an organism doesn't mean it's restricted to just taking the same form How do we of kill it? its skill set. Eat. The creatures have demonstrated the capability Salt. to reassign organic matter into completely different new tissue. If left to its own devices, we found that they could produce rudimentary venom sacs, crude wings have formed, acidic saliva glands, and even initial cranial telemetric systems. We've witnessed these things move things without touching them. ESPN. Oh, fuck me. Now you're telling me these things are telepathic? No, I'm saying they could be if the conditions were met and the evolutionary demand was concentrated enough. Essentially, they're the perfect adaptive organic machines. Oh my <sighs> god. Wonderful. Not God, Dean. Science. I'm about to bullet you in yeah, a second. Yeah, one of your little science experiments is running amok and taking people's lives. Relax. There are procedures in place for this kind of situation. The Institute can fly containment squad out here by daybreak. The storm complicates things, but I'm sure they can manage for a high-level emergency uh, like this. Are you hearing me right now? At least one of these things is out there right now, killing people and posing in their skins as replacements. Right now, we have no way of telling who's really human. Yes, we do. I can run a test that will prove definitively among us who is genuinely human, but I'm going to need samples of everyone's blood. Right. Here, take these empty needles. Collect a sample from all the remaining crew members and bring them back to me. But hurry. If we wait too long, all the cells will have already assimilated and we will have missed our chance. If we examine everyone's blood quickly, we can spot the predatory cells still in the act of fusing with the host's native blood cells. That's how we'll find out who's really one of us. Until Sounds it finds risky. out our plan. We'd have to get pretty close to someone to extract their blood. But if this will prove definitively the identity of the creature, then it's worth the risk. Right. Just don't get too close. The creature's awareness is greater as it jumps from host to host. It'll learn your behaviors and adapt to it. That's what it does. Be careful. Wonderful. We're gonna die here. I am... Whoa, oh, hell! Damn it. Don't sneak up on me like that! Ever. Sorry, I wasn't trying to. What are you doing out here in a storm like this? Everyone in the rec room is scared to be around each other. So they all scattered. Great. Right. I came out here to try to talk some sense into them. Ugh, you shouldn't be doing that, Trev. It's really not a smart idea to be out on your own right now. Come with me. Are you out here by yourself, too? Shawshank. You ain't got any creepy crawly Shawshank in their way to your guts telling you to kill me right now, right? My guess is that if I did, I wouldn't be so inclined to tell you about it, would I? I guess you wouldn't. So I suppose there ain't much point in asking. It's been a while since you ran off to check on Isabel. Anything you want to cop to? Actually, there is something. There's a helicopter being dispatched to come pick us up. Real pros. G-men, I guess. You know the type. Top-level operatives who know how to clean up a mess awesome. like this. <laughs> Finally, some good news. So what now? We just hang tight until they get here? Not quite. He's been turned. We can't risk taking Trevor's someone been turned. back with us who might be infected with the creature. Isabel's got Stop a telling him everything. Together, Damn. But I need to get a sample from everyone on deck so we can make sure we're all clean. And this test is guaranteed. No chance of a false positive, is there? You'd have to ask Isabel about that. All I know is that if I don't get the samples under the microscope, Tell Trevor too possible, much, bro. The blood from the creature is going to be impossible to distinguish from the blood of any of us. Oh, hell, man! Why didn't you say so in the first place? Hurry up and get the samples before we run out of time and you have to go back to the spray and pray technique. That's what I came up here to do. Head inside the lab and wait with Isabel. When I get back with the samples, we'll find out if anyone's not on the up and up. Oh, then we'll what just if have Trevor to turns to Isabel? Stoop. Oh my god. I want to kill Trevor. 
I'm pretty sure he's freaking monster. All right, Trev, your turn. Just need a little sample of your blood, and we can all know for a fact what you and I already know. Okay, man. Just make it quick. Let's be done with all this. Okay, you're just gonna feel a little pinch here. Man, I've gotten shots before. Just do it already. There, see? No big deal. I wanna give that to her first. So, this test of yours, could we fully count on it? Is there any chance of an error? Tell me now or consider the blood on your hands. So long as you get the samples under the microscope before every single invasive predatory cell has fully assimilated, you'll notice an obvious difference. And it better be obvious. Don't think you're in the clear just yet, Professor, as far as I'm concerned. We all need to pass the test like our life depends on it. Because it does. I'd expect nothing less. Here. You'll be needing a sample of my blood as well. All right, that should do it. Put it under the microscope and see for yourself. I'm human. Oh, so I could check it right now. Good. Uh. What's that mean? I knew Trevor was a dang monster. Dead? Looks like it. Wait a minute, I think I hear something outside. Could it be? Yeah, I was on to you, dog. Thought you were gonna play games with me? Nah. Nah, fam. Did we win? Let's go to the helicopter and then somebody will come on the plane and they'll be the monster and it'll be great. Bump for the whole family. Trevor thought he had me full, bros. <laughs> now, like, yeah, I've seen the thing. I know what to do. We're probably still gonna lose because we didn't get everybody's blood cell, but we killed the monster super quick, so we should be fine, I would think. What he was trying to do was to turn Isabel while I was gone, looking for all the blood. And then I wouldn't have been able to find out. <laughs> Dang, Trevor wasn't ready, bro. I knew it was suspicious because we told him everything. Now the question is, do we get the good end or the bad end? <laughs> Trevor just thought he was gonna be pulling a slick one. I can't believe he gave me his blood that easily. I would have figured when you got the monster dude's blood, he would have freaked out. But he just gave it to me. I feel like the plane's about to go down or something crazy. What an awesome cutscene though. I figured. And we're taking it back to civilization. Dun 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 dun. Everyone screw do do do. No news yet on just I guess how good, widespread though. infection has become, but we won. I've been told here at Channel 12 that was that easy. attacks have spread rapidly. Violence erupted across the Let's downtown area tonight I'll as people fleeing a coffee shop massacre were gunned down by military forces. Officials have claimed it was not known which of the individuals were actually human and which were creatures from another world. That's not English. Massive fires across the city tonight as chaos continues to sweep the area. The entities now being referred to as creeps have overrun nearly every part of town leaving survivors to wonder if this could be the dawning of the end of the human race as we know it. Panic-fueled riots have overtaken several business districts in the area as the invasion continues. Suspicion is at an unprecedented level as townsfolk begin to fear their neighbors and loved ones of actually being one of the creatures. 
least aren't sure just how it began, but have been quoted okay. as saying it is unlike anything they have ever encountered before. Military forces were quickly overcome on the city's west side this evening as what has only been described as some kind of alien life form overtook the area, consuming those unlucky citizens in their path. Hey guys, I guess that's the end. Attempts are being made as people flee the horde of unidentified. Thanks for watching, as always. If you'd like, please like and subscribe. Many being halted. Game was really awesome. The Pentagon is not so much. Statewide quarantine in the thing. Stop the spread of the epidemic. While rescue crews set up. I top kick Trevor though so hard. Along the perimeter of the infections. Too obvious. Trying to play me. I wonder if he's always a monster because like. Yeah, we only rank monster slayer. Is that really good? Yeah, we only killed the bad guys. Everybody else lived. We did real good. We're mo monster slayer, dude. I think that's the best you can get, probably. All right, guys. Thanks for watching, as always. And uh, yeah, that was a cool game. I'll leave a link down in the description. Apparently, it changes when you play it too, so that's really cool.